It is June 24th, 2015. We've got one year until Nibiru crosses. Something like that. It's going to pass. May, June 2016 is <clears throat> when the upheaval will occur. But before then, we're going to have the elite again deceive us, or at least attempt to deceive us, to make us think that the rapture has occurred. In, and they're, this date, September 23rd, 2015. Everyone's cooking up about this date. It's going to be trickery. Remember it said we will not know the day nor the hour. But we are going to know the month and the year, I believe. And we're going to know it through knowing, through feeling. And it's May, June 2016. I've been wrong before, but it's just been delayed, and lots of other people have predicted it, um, and they're all doing it, you know, faithfully through their heart, and because it is going to happen, and it's a cyclical event, it's happened before. But it's never happened with as many people on the planet before. And that's what's going to happen in May, June 2016. It's going to be a catastrophic event. Natural. Unavoidable. Um, and it's going to affect mostly all the coasts and stuff with water but plenty of other stuff is going to happen and it is already happening and God has given us signs and I also do get the feeling and this is just me at the moment as far as I can tell that this is when all God's children shall see God and know without a doubt that there is a God and he's our father and mother and that's going to happen in May June 2016 and what's going to happen in September 2015 is fake is what they want us so what they're going to do, yeah, so they'll probably do a fake rapture where a lot of them disappear <laughs> and they go down into the bunkers and then we're left to believe that, you know, that we're the shit left behind and that we're going to be facing some pretty apocalyptic and doomy things like a whole solar system encircling round our sun and a planet coming close and quite possibly getting hit with an asteroid or the earth undergoing some major change like expansion or you know, these new islands coming up and stuff like that. And we're supposed to think that it's because we're, you know, the un, you know, the ones who aren't forgiven or whatever. <laughs> but what we really should do is just 
trust in God and you know the world will be made anew and it probably won't be that bad if you're you know if you're quite happy and content with just the basic things in life the important things and probably be fine and probably what will do the most damage will be fear we're gonna we're tearing the veil everything is going to become known more and more is becoming known we're going to tear that veil and God's kingdom will be on earth as it is in heaven and it's going to be a good place a really good place it's going to be an awesome place but it needs to be Um, what's the proper word? <laughs> P <laughs> so give me a P. Purged, purged of the not good things that go on at the moment, like GMO foods, like pesticides, like pollution like prostitution, abortion, um, you know, all the shit that goes on, all the sex and the violence and, yeah, it's all going to be purged away. And I don't know exactly what God's plan is, I just know that you know, even though I made a prediction it was going to be May 2013 with some others like from Cliff High and stuff and AJ Miller, Jesus, he thought it was going to be November 2012. I didn't get into him until sort of late summer last year. So I hadn't known that, but interestingly, you know, we people around the world thought something was going to happen and, and still think that it is, even though it didn't happen on the dates we thought, we've all had to accept, right, we've got, you know, we're a bit out on the dates, a bit sort of panicked maybe, so, you know, this new, new sort of feelings and new understandings of everything, it's got a bit carried away perhaps, but um, no, it is, it is happening, I mean, the volcanoes haven't ceased, the earthquakes, the sinkholes, the bizarre weather, it's becoming more bizarre, animal deaths. Um, Organisations around the world with lots of secrets, secret things going on, bullshit with CERN going on, <laughs> changing the street lights in a recession. For what? That's something local. Uh, it's going on. So I reckon you got one year, one year to study and understand, get the truth, know what's going on, know the reality, because. This reality you think, or the majority of people think it is, it isn't. We all have our, we all make our own reality as we walk around to a point. Uh, one year. And, um, Things are going to get more pressured as well over this time. Um, I think the elite, obviously the, when they go into their bunkers, they want us to <laughs> destroy ourselves. 
they want us to annihilate each other. So love is going to be required. And um, don't fear. Everyone knows you're going to die one day anyway. Don't fear the physical body, because you live on. You have the potential of an eternal soul.